to say here in moving this grass is take a thin piece of plywood like this get it underneath it like this like that carry it you try to pick it up it'll just break <laughs> I think right along here off the back of this patio right here is where I want to put some next there is a little bit of bamboo sticking out around right here but I think I can just cut it loose it's not really needed there anymore and get that out of the way turf laying my little uh, side laying uh adventure going on here but actually um i'm ready to get right back on it and i want to water this down super good uh for tonight so i'm gonna get right back to what i was doing i'm probably gonna get them to bring me about the same amount again and uh and cover a little bit bigger area back here because to tell you the truth i'm enjoying it couple of my family members that are familiar with this grass they felt the same as me that spreading it out it's going to fill itself in in no time so uh yeah I, I think it's a great deal great deal all right well i'm gonna get right back here on it I think this is all I'm gonna do for the evening um, I'm really enjoying it though I'm gonna come back and water this in real good here in just a little bit and uh, think about where I'm gonna place more I, I do have a little bit left right here I don't know maybe there there might be 30 pieces left or something like that and then there's some crumbles here that I can uh, put around in some places too I just got to avoid where these guys are gonna be working I don't want to spend the money for it and it just get destroyed so i need to be a little bit strategic about it um also i would like to put it over there by those coconuts but i see melinda's got like a clothesline there no, it's just the day. and if she's over there walking on it all the time while it's trying to get established i don't think it's going to be good 
well anyway we'll see we'll see we'll get it worked out but i'm really thinking to order more from them um and get this on in as a line and just do it and get it over with um the sooner the better dry season is actually soon over with right mel yes, yes. we didn't really have a dry season this time normally everything's brown uh the grass is brown or just completely gone uh, a lot of times trees are shedding leaves because it's so dry but we did not have that this go around these people ask me do you want us to install this you know the layout for me um uh, i could have easily said just yes you know and sit inside the house in the air con watching tv up here annoying the guys while they're trying to work or something like that but you know uh i don't like to just sit on my butt and melinda she don't like to just sit on her butt we're not set on butt people she sat on her butt a lot today because she went and played tonnets <laughs> i knew that would make her mad <laughs> she don't like me to say nothing about that uh so uh so i don't like to just be sitting idle i don't and so yesterday i was cleaning out these landscaping beds down the side over here got those uh pretty well emptied out um i mean i got right down to getting the last little piece of wire and all and then i knew this grass was coming today and i was really excited for that and so um on and off today it's been my mission to deal with that between other things that i had going here but i enjoy it i enjoy it what are you gonna do just sit on your rear end you know and do nothing i i can't do that i'm just not that person that's not me um and i'm not a person that just wants to just bark orders only and not do nothing myself i made a video before um video went pretty big actually about that very thing that um, a lot of people here are shocked you know uh, and that video was called shameful shameful because in the ex relationship I was in the girl and the family was shameful of me because I was working it didn't meet what they wanted to portray of look at us now um, Oh man, they thought they done just end up landing in with a broke poor canoe, you know. Oh, he can't even pay nobody. He's got to be out there embarrassing us working. I don't care. And that's why that relationship ended because it and about a million other things. But Melinda, she values the fact that I like to work and hustle. She values the fact that I don't just pay everybody for everything. We, am I telling the truth or not, Mel? Yeah. Huh? Am I telling the truth? I mean, this is this is something we get out here and we enjoy to create together. This is a husband and wife team. My success in my life has been because I've never been lazy. There's never been nothing that I'm not willing to do myself wet get hot get dirty climb dig it doesn't matter and i won't ask anybody to do something for me that i am not willing or capable to do myself and that's just the truth it's just the truth a little checker pattern looks pretty cool in the yard huh <laughs> wish i could get two different colors of grass it'd be pretty cool to have a checkered lawn right <laughs> uh it's pretty cool well i hope you enjoyed uh just watching a uh, guy get out here and make his line and help build his dream you know not just pay somebody to create my dream get out there and build your dream remember that one